the uh, the words uh, legal and assignment. Now, how this pertains to the birth record or the statement the parents filled out, uh, the actual creation of the birth certificate is based on an event. Because legal citizenship is contract law because it deals with commerce. Uh, everything that you're going to be doing in that civil world has got to do with money. So therefore, they're creating a bond or a contract on that. And so when you look up the, uh, the definition for uh, basically assignment, it starts off, assignments, basic law, the assignment of a right or obligation is a common contractual event under the law. Okay, so we, we have to look at that. They're just saying that that is an event. So I uh, would have communication with government departments. And, and again, I'm only there trying to research. So I'm not here as an anti-government individual. Uh, I'm just here trying to make sure in good conscience I'm walking in truth. And that's the journey for those that are trying to go down a spiritual path, a narrow path that the majority of the world are not going to follow. They're going to be on the Broadway of the entertained path of fiction. But uh, the letter that came back to me one time from the Ministry of Government Services uh, that represents the Office of the Registrar General, uh, it said, to be clear, the Office of the Registrar General is responsible for registering information about events. The Office of the Registrar General does not register people. Now, we know the prophecy has come out of her, my people, so they really didn't register people because they just admitted that they didn't do that. They registered an event um, that dealt with an assignment of a legal surname because that's the only thing that was legal regarding the names that were put on the registration. The registration is the surname, it is not the given name, the given name is not legal. The given name is a fact, it's not a fiction. So when we're, um, when we're doing our due diligence on this, don't go down the assumption path that you already know this, or because you'll get caught right in the middle of it. And I know a lot of people are trying to find some way uh, to maybe capture the security. Uh, they don't realize they're already in trouble because they're already in possession of some kind of government security. Um, and if you're in adverse possession, um, then you're already part of the problem. So the uh, I would be more interested in canceling the certificate than allowing it to continue because if you cancel this certificate of debt, then you're following the spiritual course because... Right now, you're working contrary with an instrument like this because you're advancing something that advances a concept that's contrary to the spiritual message of the Bible where Jesus fulfilled the will of his Father and upon his execution of God's will, everything was paid. This is actually telling people um, it's not paid, which would be Satan's plan. So, again, everything that Satan does is contrary to truth. Uh, he runs birth control, no unauthorized reproduction of anything, whereas the mission statement of God in the beginning was be fruitful and multiply. So uh, this is not um, what I would have believed I would have woke up into. Um, and I admit, as anybody else, I was in the dark. And the only time you're going to actually see light is by searching for light and truth and uh, get yourself out of the darkness. So unfortunately, the people that are getting caught around um, the, the legal system that they're gonna try to control it are actually gonna never be able to reach that carrot. It'll always be just ahead of them because they don't, they don't have the machine that prints these instruments, but there is something that you're involved in that energizes it, that's your consent. And so the only way to remove your consent is to do it and of course you can only remove what belongs to you and have that redacted you can't redact something that doesn't so the legal system is simple uh, in its deception but it's easily got people imprinted into believing that they're part of the print which is I'm print it's the same thing I tell the people when they start becoming impatient uh, that's really I'm patient I'm the patient uh, instead of you know, being the healer, 
who will have lots of patience. So we have to realize the words have extremely solid meaning, um, and it just takes time to do the research to, to gather uh, a, a strong foundation of truth so that you're able to perceive what's going on and you'll, you'll lose the frustration, you'll lose the angered system um, that is out there now with a very solid population of people ready to rebel. Um, but unfortunately, uh, they're, not seeing, they're not seeing the path of peace and salvation uh, that's promised to those who actually follow truth. The truth will set you free.